Hi, I'm Keith. In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to send a survey when closing a case. We're also going to build the survey in this video. For the sake of this video, we're in the customer support module. So we've, we've clicked into case and we've drilled all the way into one of the cases that we're looking at. So this is an example of a case that we're ready to close. So there's two ways to do this. I can either hit the close case button here. There's also a close button right up top. Click that button. And these are some options that you can have when you're closing a case. So you can send an email to the customer by checking the email box there. Or you can add a note, you can create a task, you can submit a timesheet, or you can send a survey email. Now you'll see here that this box does not have anything in there, there's no values because we have not created a survey. So in this video we're going to demonstrate how to create a survey as well. The surveys, whether you're in the support module or whether you're in the business edition, is under the tool menu. We go to the Survey Builder, we'll cr click Create New. We'll just run through how to create a survey real quickly. You can create HTML before and after the survey. These are a few different options that will allow the results to show. In this case, I'm not going to limit the start or end date. I'm just going to add two simple questions to this survey. So this is just a simple survey with five drop-down choices. My display sequence is going to go just in order, zero, starting at zero. So zero, one, two, three, four. So that's my first question that I've added to my survey. My second question, in this case, I'm just going to do a, a long text box. It's going to say, We're just going to ask for the reason of the answer that was given. So there's just two quick questions that are part of the survey. You can preview the survey by clicking this box right here. How satisfied were you? And please provide the reason for the answer you gave. That's just a real brief survey. So now that we've got a survey created, we'll go back to our case. And all I should need to do right here is click the refresh button. So we're just going to reload this page. And now in my survey menu, I've got an option to send the close case survey. It pops in the email template. Now you can change this email template in the email template section. So now when I send this out, it's going to record that to the process log. It's going to close my case. And here we are inside my inbox where I can see this survey that was received. The link to the survey. So that survey can be sent out to anybody that you close a service ticket for. And the results of that survey will be tracked in the survey builder under the stats tab. Survey builder section under that particular survey under the stats tab. You'll be able to see the results of that particular survey.